should I pay for mastering? Do your records on your record label need to be mastered? I was just talking to an artist who has millions of followers and is super successful. And we were just talking yesterday on the podcast. And he told me that when he first got started, he made a track on his laptop and he uploaded it to SoundCloud. And he didn't even know what mastering was at the time. He has since gone on to have millions of followers and be extremely successful. Now he gets his music mastered. But in the early stages, it was all about being raw, being nimble, being quick on the draw, getting music to their audience, being prolific as an artist. And so I want you to stop worrying about these things that you think you should do. Just get music to people. People like music that's honest and raw. Don't worry so much about mastering. Well, what if one song is louder than the rest? Or what if it doesn't sound very good? Or what if Spotify's limiting process messes things up? Don't worry about that. Fans are smart. They're compassionate. They're not going to not listen to your music because it's not mastered. A volume level or a subtle EQ or a subtle compression isn't going to change whether or not people love your music or not. It's going to help. And down the road, when you've made a bit more money, when you have some more context, then yes, mastering is one of those things that people do eventually, but don't let it stop you from releasing music. If you can't afford it, then there are some online options. But if you don't like that, or if you can't afford it, don't worry about it. What's important is that you get music to people. One record that I absolutely love was uh, is a three-song EP. A friend of mine, before we were friends, he released it to Bandcamp. I downloaded it. I listened to it nonstop for about two months until I finally reached out to him, signed him to my label, and we started working on his full-length record. And I was asking him about that EP that I had listened to, and he told me he didn't master it. He just made it in Logic and then uploaded the MP3s like right to Bandcamp. And I had no idea that it wasn't mastered. And I I know mastering. I, I I know mixing and I know that kind of stuff. And so, and I didn't even notice. I just was there for the music. I love the melodies. I, I love the production that he did. I just didn't care about mastering. So don't worry about these things. These are one of these things that we use as a way, as an excuse to slow us down. Don't worry about mastering. When the time comes, then start worrying about mastering. Just get music to people. I hope you found this helpful. Go to otherrecordlabels.com where we have so many resources paid and free for record labels, otherrecordlabels.com.